or his fare. So I'm glad to see that he seems to have recovered from JBL's unprovoked assault last week. Unprovoked? Unprovoked, Cole. He was walking up behind JBL's partner. The champ wouldn't be caught up in this grudge match tonight if it wasn't for his partner's actions last week. So what's the big deal, miss? He's the champ. He's a fighting champ. The champ's got to compete in matches now and then. And it's not like this is a title match, so what's the big deal? Sold-out crowd in Memphis, Tennessee is on its feet. Michael Cole and Taz at ringside, all set for another exciting evening of SmackDown action. Hey, we're bigger than Elvis tonight, Cole. Crowd can't wait. That's a big play to make, Taz. But you might just be right. Elvis is only one superstar, but SmackDown's got a whole locker room full of them. I don't think there's a superstar in the history of WWE who's gone from rookie to WWE champion as quickly as John Cena has. You're told, but you said it yourself. John Cena has shot up real quick. He ain't picked up the experience that a lot of other superstars have, and that could be a little bit of a problem for him. Well, from where I sit, I haven't seen a lot of superstars give Cena much of a problem. He's held his own against some of the most talented veterans on the roster. That's the problem, Cole. You're calling it the way you see. I've actually been in the ring on my feet. And I'm saying back in my day, I would have loved to be in the ring with a kid as cocky as Cena because I would have took him to school. A great many superstars have tried to do just that task, but Cena's still here. This isn't some wet behind the ears rookie. He's a WWE champion. And that's talking about adding insult to injury. And these fans love it. Yeah, well, you know what? He better worry more about the injury and less about the insult until his match is over. Whoa! I think these fans have got a little something. Great reversal! I think that if one of these superstars successfully executes their finishing move, this one is over. That ain't necessarily the case, Cole. Just because it's called a finisher doesn't mean it always ends the match. Sound like you're speaking from experience here, Taz. Of course not. Whenever I locked in the Taz mission, that was it. End of story. It was over. I think you're developing a selective memory in your old age, partner. This could be three right here. One, two, Come on. That had to be three. And the crowd is coming alive. Here's the pin. This could be One, it. Two, Kicked out just in the nick of time. You know, Cole, I'd ask you who you were pulling for in this match, but I think it's pretty obvious since the beginning who you're rooting for. I never claim to be completely objective, Taz. It's no secret I respect superstars who stick within the rules and show some sportsmanship in the ring. You gotta understand, Cole, I know it ain't exactly kosher, but you're putting your body on the line in there. You gotta do whatever it takes to protect yourself and pick up the win. Guys, you're talking about two different things. Going outside the rules in the name of self-defense is one thing. But cheating to steal a victory and enhance your own career is something completely different. This capacity crowd is making their opinions known tonight. No surprise there, Cole. The WWE fans ain't exactly known for keeping their opinions to themselves. Nice reversal. I hope this isn't the last time you see these superstars face off. You're not going to hear me say this much, Cole, but I definitely agree with you. This has all the makings of a nice, long feud. I don't know how nice it is, but there are certainly some issues between these superstars, and I think this yeah. match might only exasperate. Please, Cole, watch your language, will you? It's a family show. I said exasperate. Not, oh, never mind. Oh, man, these fans are fired up now. They sure are, and you know that's going to have an effect on this match. These WWE fans just can't get enough of these superstars. And I'm glad to see it. A WWE match isn't just about competition. It's, he's got his opponent on the ground. Could this be it? This is it, all right. STFP. I've been locked in this hole before, and it hurts even worse than it looks. I can't even imagine the amount of pain that this hole must inflict on Look any right. superstar who winds up in it. Mr. Kennedy, he's got it all. He's got the look, he's great on the stick, and he knows how to get it done in the ring. 
Yeah, and if you don't believe him, just ask him. He won't hesitate to tell you how great he is. Yeah, so? What's wrong with that? Can't lease the total package? Like you, you're a punch. I think we're hearing the First Amendment in action here tonight, Taz. It's a great thing to hear, Cole. I'm all in favor of freedom of expression. Whether I... Oh, man, this is just about the last hole you want to find yourself in. I can imagine. Just look at the pressure being applied here. I think these fans know what's coming next. You know it, Cole. The F.U. Man, get a little bit. I think we know where he's going with this, Cole. Here he comes. The F.U. He just broke his own heart and the ground. He smells blood in the water, Cole. He's going straight for the submission. And this could prove to be a decisive... Whoa. See, Cole, I knew it. Kennedy was looking to take out the champ last week. And here comes JBL like a house of fire. He's coming to the aid of his partner, just like he did last week, Cole. You see that, Cole? Anything you want to take back now? I don't know, Taz. I'm not convinced. You okay, champ? Listen. No mercy's a week from Sunday, and you don't have a challenger yet. And, well, I, I, was, I was thinking. I knew JBL had a...